The bird owners like, like to bring their birds here because uh, they want to train their birds. They cannot be kept alone at home. They need company to sing to each other and so improve their singing ability. I'm Robin Chua. I'm a community volunteer. My member of parliament asked me to help up looking after Kebun Baru Bird Singing Club. And I've been doing it for 10 years or so. We have a bird display here every day, but uh, on Sundays and public holidays, uh, most of the bird owners will be here and they, they will bring all kinds of birds. Behind me uh, is an arena for zebra dove, which are hung uh, about 20 feet high. And they are there the whole afternoon because these birds, they are not afraid of the sunshine. And further away, uh, you see the long-tailed shama, the red whiskered bobo, as well as the oriental white eye. It's easier to keep birds than having cats and dogs because uh, birds are very small and they can be put in a cage, uh, they're given uh, some bird seeds and water, and, and that's it. If it's a young bird, uh, it could be just a few hundred dollars, but if it's a competition prize winner, it could go into thousands of dollars. You know. Many of the bird owners, they are very passionate uh, and they come here very early in the morning, uh, even before 6 a.m., when uh, it's still dark in Singapore, and enjoy their morning cup of coffee and uh, listen to their bird singing as well. More time spent with the birds than with the family. But there's a good thing uh, about them spending a lot of time here also, rather than spending time in the casino, which is a very negative type of pursuit.